This is a quick guide on how to edit the appearance of your itineraries through your Trip Creator account. So first things first, go to the menu dashboard in the upper right corner and make your way to the admin settings. Here we're going to make our way to the itinerary tab where you will see all of the itinerary templates and appearances that are available in your Trip Creator library. But if you want to create a new one from scratch, just press the plus create new button here. And here you will see all of all types of uh, confusing things. So the first things you the first thing you're going to notice is a big itinerary preview that you can use as a test subject uh, that you can customize to your choosing. So you get a general idea of how the template or appearance will look like. And this will change as you change uh, the uh, these options to the left here along the way. So first things first, I'm going to choose a title for my itinerary appearance. So we're going to name this one test. You can add an itinerary backlink title to your appearance and an itinerary backlink URL. Now you can also add your own logo to your itinerary. So that would be uh, some images that you have in your system so would be, would probably be uh, the logo of your company or whatever. Uh, you can also manage the primary color of the itinerary. So let's change it right here. As you can see, some of the text here, underlying text here changes. You can also edit the call to action background color and the call to action text color. Now here under the general tab, you have all types of options that you can choose to disable or enable uh, in your itinerary. So if you want to hide uh, features in your preview, such as context, you don't want to sh show the context in the preview, uh, you can disable that. You can uh, choose to disable, for example, trip reference numbers. So take a look at this one, I turn a reference number here, you press disable, and it disappears. So the idea with this is to customize the itinerary to keep it as simplistic or detailed as possible. Now we can also change all of these things right here, fees, total price, distances, anything about that, anything like that. Um, you can also choose to disable something about the company or something about the agent and TNC policies as well. Now below that we have all types of all the types of content that is in your uh, itinerary. So if you want to uh, maybe edit each and every content to which type it belongs to. So let's say we want to keep flights as minimalistic looking as possible. We would just disable um, most of these features right here. So the th only thing we maybe want to see is a uh, duration, how long the flight takes. Reference numbers and all that can be hidden, but maybe I want to keep uh, activities as detailed as possible and I will keep all of these options enabled. Now, when you're done uh, editing the itinerary printing so that you're satisfied with how your itinerary preview looks like, you're just going to press save. There you will have the itinerary preview or uh, itinerary appearance in your uh, trick creator library. So when I go to trick creator and I go into uh, one of my trips, I can actually choose and let's see here, let's go to preview. Then we can change the appearance right here. Press the appearance. There we have test two that we just created and press save. So it will automatically transform into the template that you just created uh, a while ago in the itinerary settings. So this is how you change the itinerary appearance for your trip creator itinerary.